Okay, um, so today I am trying Indian snacks. Um, this is part of the Multicultural Children's Book Club um, that I co-host with Amy Tai the first Thursday of every month at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And so the August 2021 book club is celebrating Raksha Banham, a Hindu holiday, and we, we will be using bracelets for Veena's Brothers um, by Rajani LaRocca and illustrated by Chaya pra Prabhat. I hope I said that right. And, um, and I have something really special because I have Indian snacks that were selected by India's welterweight champion, beautified um, champion, Vibo Sin Yadav. And he is my trainer at Noninta Boxing Club here. Um, and he took me to the Indian market and um, selected his favorite Indian snacks. Um, I have a video of that and I'll put that in the down box here. And now I'm just going to go through and try all the snacks and let you know what I think because all these snacks are part of the giveaway for our August Multicultural Children's Book Club. We do a book club in a box giveaway. It includes the book, the snacks, because I bought two of each. Um, also the artwork that's created by Amy Tai specifically for this book. And she also includes the materials um, to do the book club, and that we, we hope that whoever wins our book club will celebrate Raksha Bundam in their own way, because um, they'll have everything ready to go. Okay, the first thing is chai. Um, and so usually um, Vibo uses a different brand, but I didn't want to buy like a giant box, so he picked this one for me, because it's just um, how many tea bags? It's um, not so many, um, but this is chai because our theme is sort of like chai tea time, like a snack with chai, which he says they have chai snacks. <laughs> he has them often <laughs> throughout the day, but he said, especially late afternoon is a great time to have a cup of chai and then, of course, um, some snacks. And he even in his video goes through the sequence of snacks that he has, starting from like more drier biscuits to dunk in the tea to like moving on to cookies and other snacks. So this is Brick Bond Red Label Nature Care, um, an Ayurvedic um, chai. And I think it's loose leaf. It has five natural ingredients, ashwanga, muthili, tulsi, cardamom, and ginger. So I think you just brew it um, like you would tea. Um, it says prepare with boiling water and milk. Um, yeah, so that, that looks fun. So the first one he said um, that people should try that is, I, I wouldn't say this is his total favor, but this is a biscuit called Parl G. And he said that, let me try it. Mm, it's good. It's just like a really crisp, plain cookie. Um, what does it remind me of? Almost like a Lorna Dune, but Lorna Dunes are like kind of more buttery and these are more plain, but they're really good. They're sweet. And so he said that um, the reason why this cookie is so popular is that it's very inexpensive and it contains glucose and that when they do um, kind of charity and giving food away, they always include this biscuit because of the glucose and because it's inexpensive. Um, so um, at the Indian store, they had like huge packages of these cookies because you would like give away huge packages, I guess, if you're able to. And I just got the small one just to try it. But yes, they're very good. Um, the second one that he really likes is this cookie. Um, good Day for Britannia. And he likes the pista almond, so like pistachio and almond flavored. It comes in other flavors, but I had him just pick out his favorite. Mmm, really good. It's crumbly and definitely more buttery. And then you get a hint of the pistachios and maybe a little bit of the almonds. Maybe the almonds also make it like lighter and crunchier delicious. Well, I don't know if we have an equivalent cookie 
But it does remind me of all the, um, what is it, cookies that like, maybe like a Girl Scout cookie, not like a plain one. Okay, the next one is, now this is Vibo's absolute favorite cookie. Um, it's also by Britannia 5050. It calls it a cracker. It's called the Moxa Shasta. And it looks like it's lemon and lime. I mean, it actually has like, the picture is like butter, like a thing of butter and like almost like green onions. I thought it was like lemon and lime, but I don't think it is. But he said he really likes this cookie because it's like a little bit sour and a little bit savory. I don't know if it's a cracker or a cookie. Oh, it's a cracker. Hmm. I thought it was a cookie because it's the same package, but it's a cracker. It's very light. It reminds me of like a, a Ritz cracker. I don't know if I showed you close-ups, but let me show you a, cl a close-up of the pista almond cookie. And here is a close-up of the Parl G, which says Parl G on it. That's the one that has glucose. And then a lot of people talk about the hide-and-seek cookies being their favorite. I have the chocolate, but Vivo also really likes the, um, oh, this one's broken. He also really likes the strawberry version. So I'm just going to, I have a broken one, but let me get you. Mmm. That is really good. Oh, this is the hide and seek. Um, it's like, um, it's very crispy and has really good chocolate flavor. I guess it reminds me of a chocolate chip. But I actually don't like chocolate chip as much because they're not as crispy. And I don't know, the flavor. I just like the chocolate chip part of the chocolate chip cookies. Um, yeah, this is probably my favorite chocolate chip cookie. Hide and seek. Made with the world's finest chocolates and the world's best molded chocolate chip cookies. They're definitely molded. Yeah. These are actually my favorite. Okay, so Vibo says that in addition to cookies, especially cookies you can dunk into the chai, they also have like a savory snack mix that you eat. Um, and there's all kinds. It was an, actually an entire wall of snacks. And so he had kind of a hard time actually choosing one. But then he just selected this one because he thought, he thought, he, I mean, he likes them all. But he said, this one is good because he thinks um, everyone else will like it. And so, let's see. Mmm. This is a garlic mix. It's a little bit spicy. It has a little kick, almost like a cayenne kick. It's super crunchy. It's got like little balls. They're, I thought they were chickpeas. I don't think they are chickpeas. They're like little balls. And then like little twiggy things. There's actually peanuts in here um, and pea flour. Um, curry leaves and turmeric powder. So if you're allergic to nuts, peanuts, this is this will not work for you. Um, yeah, but it's delicious. It's addicting. This is something you could just sit and mindlessly eat handfuls of. Um, so yeah, that is our snack giveaway. If you um, join us um, the first Thursday of August, it's coming up. I have to look up the exact day. Then you can win this entire package, including the book, the snacks, the artwork, and the materials to make the artwork. So please join us for Multicultural Children's Book Club. And thank you so much for watching. And I hope you guys try Indian snacks as well. And I hope you like um, the ones that Vibo and I, Vibo recommended and I tried. Thank you.